Do you remember the jets that stole the spotlight in Top Gun Maverick movie? While they dazzled on the big screen, their real-world capabilities are even more impressive. With futuristic design, unmatched speed, and lethal weaponry, this aerial predator slices through the toughest enemy defenses with ease. Wondering what fighter jet is it? Let's take a closer look. Born from the legendary McDonnell Douglas F.A. 18 Hornet, the Super Hornet took to the skies in 1995, quickly becoming the backbone of the U.S. Navy and Marine Corps. With enhanced capabilities over its predecessor, this jet is one of the most versatile and lethal fighters in modern warfare. Imagine a fighter jet capable of performing almost any mission on the modern battlefield. The Super Hornet can maneuver nimbly in air combat, launch precision strikes on ground targets, and even conduct reconnaissance missions. This flexibility makes it an invaluable asset for modern air forces. But how does the Super Hornet pull off missions that no other jet can? And what if Ukraine were to add this powerhouse to its lineup after acquiring F-16s? Let's explore further. Here it is, the fighter jet full of character, the F-18 Super Hornet, affectionately nicknamed Rhino. This nickname isn't just a label. It comes from the distinctive bulge on the front of the aircraft's redome, reminiscent of a rhinoceros's strength. Like its name, the Super Hornet symbolizes resilience and exceptional fighting spirit in the world of air combat. Since entering service in 1999, the F-18 Super Hornet has taken over the role of the F-14 Tomcat and has quickly captured the hearts of various countries. From the United States, Australia, and Kuwait. Its diverse user base demonstrates just how versatile this aircraft is in various combat missions. To truly appreciate the power of the Super Hornet, we only need to look back at its predecessor, the Hornet. This aircraft proved its capabilities during Operation Desert Storm, where it successfully shot down enemy fighters and bombed strategic targets. Furthermore, when hit by direct surface-to-air missile attacks, the Hornet showcased its resilience by recovering and being ready to fly again the next day, a true testament to the toughness and survivability that define this aircraft. The F-A-18 Super Hornet, a larger and more powerful successor to the F-A-18 Hornet, boasts a maximum takeoff weight of 66,000 pounds a range of 1,275 nautical miles, 50% greater than its predecessor, and speeds of up to Mach 1.6, making it one of the most advanced fighter jets available. That's because powered by two General Electric F414 turbofan engines, each producing up to 17,000 pounds of thrust, The Super Hornet combines power with agility, enhanced by its aerodynamic design that allows for high speeds and complex maneuvers. Also with modern avionics, it can detect and track multiple targets from long distances. Its armament includes a range of air-to-air -air weapons like the AIM-120 Amram and AIM-9 Sidewinder, as well as air-to-ground missiles such as the AGM-65 Maverick and AGM-84 Harpoon plus precision bombs, including joint direct attack munitions, and a 20 mm cannon for engaging nearby threats. With a proven combat record, the F-A-18 Super Hornet has been involved in numerous historic missions, ranging from Operation Southern Watch in the 1990s to shooting down two Iraqi MiG aircraft and participating in Operation Enduring Freedom in Afghanistan. Operation Iraqi Freedom, 
Operation Odyssey Dawn, and Operation Inherent Resolve. If you're looking for a fighter jet that combines versatility and strength, the F-18 Super Hornet is the right choice to reign supreme in the skies. Its capabilities are further enhanced by test pilot Ty Grouch Frouchy, who describes flying the Super Hornet as an unforgettable experience. Its advanced cockpit, featuring large displays that consolidate all information, offers a much more intuitive and efficient flying experience. This represents a significant enhancement, not just for the aircraft, but also for the pilots who operate it. It's like having a window into the battlefield, providing a very clear and tactical overview of the surrounding situation. It's truly a giant leap in aviation technology. The arrival of F-16s in Ukraine is like a refreshing sip of water in the desert. This advanced fighter jet is expected to balance air power in a prolonged conflict. However, behind the dazzling technology, the F-16 is a product of a different era. Designed before the stealth era, the F-16 has a relatively large radar profile, making it vulnerable to modern Russian air defense systems. The F-16 may be better suited for defensive missions, such as air patrols or strikes against less protected targets. If that's the case, why not consider the F-A-18 Super Hornet as an alternative? This aircraft is designed with more advanced technology, including improved stealth capabilities. The Super Hornet can be likened to a modern ninja, able to move silently and incapacitate enemies without detection. Of course, transitioning from the F-16 to the Super Hornet is not a simple task. Pilots would need to undergo lengthy and intensive training, and the supporting infrastructure would also need to be adapted. However, if Ukraine can effectively operate the Super Hornet, they would have a far more lethal air asset. This aircraft is not only capable of dominating the skies, but also providing better air support for ground forces. So, do you think the delivery of F-16s and potentially Super Hornets will end the conflict in Ukraine? Leave your thoughts and thanks for watching. From the United States, Australia, and Kuwait.